I woke up this morning, uh, checked Twitter out, and uh, noticed that my friend Black Rhino had tried out Gaikai. And I'm like, hey, man, how'd you try out Gaikai? Every time I try, it always tells me my connection's not good. Well, today, apparently, you can play Gaikai uh, for free now. All these demos and stuff. We're going to go right into the Dead Space 2 one and check that out. Now, the, only, the, the one thing that really bugs me about Gaikai is... Um, notice it says PC right there. Well, okay, it's PC, awesome. But what if you're on a Mac and you're playing this? Because this is browser-based, right? What if you're on a Mac and you're trying out the, the games on the browser and stuff? You're like, hey, you know what? I want to buy that. You can't. It's not Mac compatible. And, I mean, you know, EA, they have a lot of Mac compatible titles. All they're doing is taking Wine, which on Linux is a Windows compatibility layer to let you play games and open up apps and stuff like that from Windows. And they're taking that and basically modifying it for Mac. So it's not native. It's just a really cheap way of porting over Mac and having it run like crap. All right, and then we have the Gaikai logo. All right, shift and escape, unlock your mouse. They got the help. Okay, let's just get right into this. Whoa. This, this is a very floaty mouse. Wow, okay. All right, maybe when we get in the game, I won't do that, but let's see here. All right, skip all that. So yeah, I'm, I usually, you know, play on on live, so I'm, you know, on Steam as well. And I, I you know, floating mouses, you would expect to have it on on live most of the time. In menus you will, but in the game you won't. And here I have some floating mouse. This is, this is weird. What is going, okay. I think I understand what looks funky about this little scene here. Alright, we have the guy, low quality texture on his armor because well you're gonna be in the dark anyway it doesn't really need to look that good but then they're bumping up the bump mapping to extraordinary levels so that it stands out in the video like I mean look at the bump map on that thing that is not freaking normal they, they need to make it so deep so that you actually see it in the stream but let's just let's just get going here man I'm not gonna get used to this freaking floaty mouse okay all right got it um, man okay this just there's such a disconnect all right let's just get going see look at that bump map I, it's, they've they turned up the bump mapping so so deep that it uh it just looks really... I don't know. It just looks off. See, now we're in the dark, so the armor doesn't really matter. I don't know. Something about it just looks off. And I, I know I keep saying that, but... Oh, right, yeah. Hey, guys. How y'all doing? Alrighty. The sound also, the sound is very tinny. Um, like it's coming out, I, I got a really nice uh, pair of tri uh, Triton headset. Um, and it's not surround sound, that's for sure. It's just stereo. And uh, kind of cheap stereo at that, but whatever. You know, it's supposed to be just a demo, but... Uh, right. Okay. Yeah, aim that thing. All right, so let's say if I actually wanted to buy this thing, just uh, hit that, and they got a buy button right there. EA Store here, and um, it's, you know Dead Space Two, platform PC. So yeah, I'm, I'm if I'm demoing this on a Mac, yeah, I'm SOL. Can't run this on a Mac. 
if I'm playing this on Linux, oh, yep, sorry, can't run this on Linux. I mean, there's there's some ways you can get it to run on Mac and Linux without having it to be made for the platform, but on Mac, it takes like four to five hours to even set up Wine, and who knows if it's even going to work after that. On Linux, you know, it, it's you're in the same, you know, kind of point. It doesn't take nearly as long to set up Wine, but who knows if it's actually going to work. Um, I, you know, I... I like EA. I like I like their games. It's old. I like their games. I don't like EA. They make horrible business decisions, um, and I, I don't see why they have to go with Origin and leave Steam away. I don't see why they have to, uh, you know, go with Gaikai and leave OnLive away. It, it can't, why can't it be on both systems? You know, OnLive I think does things a lot better. You can get the full game. You have a community there. It's it's nice. Here, you it's just so. Something is off about it. It doesn't feel like a game. It feels like a, a paper cutout, kind of like a, I don't even know, like it's mimicking a game, but it's not really a game. It's it's hard to explain, but you can check it out at gaikai.com, or you can check out OnLive at OnLive.com. But uh, either way, EA really needs to figure out what they're going to do. I, I think they should go back to OnLive, have their demos on Gaikai if they want, Go back to OnLive because people want to play their games on there. Um, this is Sayino, and uh, I'll catch you later.